Breaking but not so shocking news. Donald Trump has won the New Hampshire Republican primary caucus, defeating Nikki Haley. I predicted Trump would get about 55 to 60% of the vote. There's only 31% reported right now, and he currently has around 53 to 54%. And considering a lot of the liberal, aka pro Haley counties, are already gone, this means that Donald Trump will probably get around the range that I said, meaning 55 to 60% of the vote. I'll address Trump in a second, but the message is clear. To Nikki Haley and anyone else who represents the neocon establishment Bush Republican Party of the old, you need to understand this is no longer the party of George W. Bush and Dick Cheney. I thought that message was sent well and clear in 2016 with Jeb Bush's failure, but I guess not because Nikki Haley tried to be the female version of George W. Bush. And despite the establishment news media on both sides, whether it's CNN or Fox News propping her up big time, it didn't work out. Donald Trump is going to be the nominee. And why is that? Because this is no longer the party of neoconservatism and globalism. This is now the party of America first conservatism with Donald Trump, Vivek Ramaswamy, and Ron DeSantis. Now, the reason that Trump got it instead of Vivek or DeSantis is simple, because Trump voters are very energetic and they made sure to come out and make their voices heard and vote for Donald Trump as they think that his presidency was stolen from him from the Democrats. But as I said from the beginning, while I was a big supporter of Vivek and DeSantis, the end goal was just to have a true America first conservative as the nominee. And that's who we got in Donald Trump. So now that it's obvious we're going to defeat neocon Nikki Haley, it's on to defeat Joe Biden. Trump 2024.